Well, 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 that was Yahweh by Jokia. What an incredible track. Oh my word, I just love it indeed. He is Yahweh. Uh, for you, our dear listeners and viewers, this is the midday talk session where we uh, invite incredible business owners, um, people that are moving and, sh- and shaping, you know, P- Port Elizabeth, people that are influencing, you know, uh, the community for the good. Uh, if you're tuning in right now, you're tuning into goodness. Here, we share value in this conversation that we hope that uh, you take something of great and incredible meaning. Uh, thank you so much for tuning in for those who are uh, tuning in on our Facebook. Uh, um, I'm just going to introduce the guest who is seated op- opposite of me. Uh, it's me, your host, John. And the time now is exactly one minute past 1 p.m. And we have our guest with us uh, seated opposite of me is Pumelelo Christopher of uh, Chris Solution images hi chris uh hello sir how are you doing awesome i'm uh, great man it's great to have you thank you for having me thank awesome. you for having me awesome um just to um give a brief information about um you know what you do we're going to read your biography shortly but do you have anyone in mind who might be tuning in right now or watching us live that you'd like to give a shout out <laughs> maybe it's family and friends uh yo uh, the, um I think some of my Facebook friends actually are watching mm. watching and tuning in online. Um so I'm I'm not gonna mention names. <laughs> I'm not gonna mention names. <laughs> you don't wanna leave anyone yeah, out. No, I'm not gonna leave anyone out. So awesome. I'll just give a shout out to all of my Facebook friends, mm. all of my business partners, everyone I've worked with, and my family. Um, my son, if he's listening, and my family, yes, mm. that's about it, that's about it. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. So, ladies and gentlemen, um, thank you for tuning in. This is going to be an incredible session, uh, which we believe you take some value out of it. Um, so, Chris is the owner of an incredible business here in the Bay called Chris Solution Images. Um he founded the image in the year, uh, sorry, the business in the year 2020 with the mission to become the leading provider of affordable, responsive, value added services in the multimedia industry. Their vision is to build a distinct brand known specifically for its innovation and delivering exceptional customer service. Christopher works alongside two others, that is Ntsika and Tobela. Shout out to you guys who are working alongside uh, this incredible gentleman. Uh, They play major roles in delivering the excellent service. They have done a lot of amazing projects in the past, such as a collab with True FM on the show called The Urban Exchange. Uh, And one thing that even we have had a conversation about is that once you, um, you know, go get some, you know, photos taken by, you know, um, Christopher Solutions, um, you own 100% rights. That's absolutely uh, to the photos upon completion. So Chris, I just want to find out from you, um, when did this start? And please let us know how you started out Mm -hmm. because we believe um, we don't want um, to give uh, falsified information. Mm -hmm. You know, many times uh, we only see businesses when they're thriving, Mm -hmm. you know, when they're big, Mm -hmm. you know, they're doing well and they're, you know, cashing in. Uh, Please tell us how you started the very beginning of things what inspired you and how your two colleagues joined you? Sure. All right. Um, as our conversation uh, just next door, the we, our, our Chris Solution Images is a baby mm. of Chris Solution Enterprise. Mm. So Chris Solution Enterprise is the registered one. Mm. And then Chris Solution Images falls under Chris Solution Images. Mm. And Chris Solution Images was established in July 2020, mm, okay. right after... Chris Solution Enterprise did a project, a live stream project. Okay. So we were July 2020. We had the equipment, mm. and then after we had the equipment, uh, I, I thought of okay, I've got equipment, I've got mm. cameras, mm. I've got sound equipment. What can I do? Because mm. yeah. then in July 2020, I still didn't have the qualification to actually handle a camera. Mm. But mm. we managed to actually do a live stream mm. out of all of that, and then 
2020 we started but it was a live streams we started with live streams mm. yes, we started with live streams the first live stream we did was uh, of an artist called um static flow okay yeah she's from the bay, bay mm. best she's a female, <laughs> artist, female artist female rapper oh, and that was our first live stream and then after that Yes, we actually, I actually managed to rope in two guys. Mm. And then, because there's Unseka. Unseka mm. was a host mm. at the live stream, okay. on, on the live stream. Mm. He was a host there, mm -hmm. hosting for that live stream. And then after the live stream, he told me that, no, man, anytime you want assistance um, for the jobs, the video jobs, mm. the video jobs, so producing or script writing or anything, I'm your guy. Mm. And then I said, yeah, seriously, <laughs> and he said, "Yeah, seriously," because Ziga is uh, also qualified with mm. the same qualification I have, okay. and he also has extensive um, uh, experience because he's actually starred in uh, local productions. Wow! And he's also done like producing for local artists. Mm. So I was like. Like, thanks, man, because you've got experience and mm. I don't have experience. No, mm. man, it's, it's chilled. Mm -hmm. We can work together and then we'll just decide in future what happens. And then that's how I wrote in Sika. Mm. And then Utolela, which is known as Upitology. Mm. And I was still at school when he actually came around to, mm. to, 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 to work with Kusuro's Images. Mm. And because he saw a picture of me holding a boom swinger. <laughs> <laughs> Since he's a sound engineer, he, he liked the picture. And then he hit me up on the inbox and said, man, anytime you want scoring or you want your sound to be assisted on your mm -hmm. video, on your visuals mm -hmm. for your company, Hit me up, I'm your guy. And I was like, okay, this is crazy now because <laughs> I hold him in a high, 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 high esteem. Because no. yes. he's worked with the, 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 the biggest artist mm. in South Africa wow. and internationally. Wow. So out of him saying that, if you want assistance, mm. I'm your guy. I was mm. like, oh, my <laughs> prayers have been answered. I'm praying to the right one here. <laughs> so that's how we started working with... Um, uh, Chris Olusemi is starting working with uh, Insika and mm. Pitology. And there's also uh, Um Chobeli, which is Diwan. Mm. Diwan, we also work with Diwan with a lot of our projects. Mm. But due to him having his own company, mm. um, he ended up, um, he, the company ended mm. up taking most of his time. Okay, so now okay. it's just three guys. Mm. It's just me, Chris, mm. and Sika, mm. and uh, Pitology, which is Utobela. Wow. So, yes. Absolutely. Yeah. Well, this is absolutely amazing. You know, um, not every company usually uh, finds, I can say, all ducks in a row. Mm -hmm. As you said, you know, uh, it just seemed, you know, to be like these guys were just like eager mm -hmm. and keen, you know, to work alongside you. It means they were in the same... Um, holding the same vision, mm. same passion, yes, kind yes. of things, and that, probably that's one uh, incredible things uh, to consider whenever mm. you want to partner or have colleagues that work with you. Must be you know lined up mm. in the same vision, in the same passion. Yes. Cool. So now you've built this incredible things. It's been uh, about a year and a half, you know, yeah. running 2020, close to yes. twenty twenty. So yeah, and a half, approximately, yeah, yes. and that's amazing. Um, I mean, that's a statement that you put out there, you know, when you were launching, you know, and running with this thing, because not everybody launches a business mm -hmm. and holds it up mm -hmm. this long. Yes. You know, many people three months, four months down the line, you know, just like, I don't know what I started this. Where's my CV? <laughs> Where's my CV? <laughs> I know. <laughs> so, um, please let us know how you built this. As you said, you know, uh, this brand, mm -hmm. you know, Christopher Solutions. Mm -hmm. Because especially in this industry, photography and multimedia, mm -hmm. you know, you're very visual. Mm -hmm. You know, you're out there, mm -hmm. you are seen and you are, you are you're known. Tell us the kind of work. Mm -hmm. Many times we just see these amazing photos and, and videos, but we don't know what really goes on behind the scenes. Tell us the kind of work that goes on to build a brand in this industry. Yo, it's a tough one. <laughs> Yo, it's a tough one. Right there, what you said, mm. the kind of work that mm. goes into what you generally see, for example, that banner behind you, mm. or a picture of uh, models at Green Acres, mm. or maybe you are watching TV. TV and you see a fully finished production. Mm. The work that goes into actually building um, such a company, it's 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 you know, it's extensive. Mm. It's extensive. Mm. First mm. off, you have to have focus. You have to have a vision, sure. and you have to know what you're doing. Mm. Those mm. three things are main. You have to know what you're doing because one, clients give you. Mm. 
um, money so mm. that you can actually take good um, content for them. Mm. Mm. That content has to last like it could be forever. Mm. It could, could be pictures. It could be a, a, a video of a funeral. It mm. could be a video of a wedding, depending on the occasion. So it, that, that work would be delivered in a flash drive or in mm. a CD or mm. in a link from a cloud. Mm. The children are going to watch it. The children, sure. children are going to watch it. Sure. And generational is going mm. to continue. Mm. So it's that that you have to have focus. You have to know what you're doing. Because mm. if you don't know what you're doing, you're actually going to flop. Mm. You're going to flop. You're not sure. going to make it. Sure. You're not going to make it. You're going to have a bad reputation. Mm. And so far, I could say the clients that we've worked with, mm. I could say we've gotten good feedback. Mm. Wow. We've gotten good feedback. And that's why we are still running. at it. We are mm. still running. And most of the time, I, I like the fact that all of us are... Um, have the the vision, the mm. same vision, mm. the same focus, and um, the space we are in. We know where to go, how to do it, and yeah, because all of us are in this industry, knowing that we are doing visuals, mm. and whenever we get a like, we get like a job. We, we it's, it's called pre production. Mm. We first have. Mm ask questions, what do you want, how do you want it? And then we go scout the place. Mm. After scouting the place, we have to find out where we're going to set up. Mm. And after finding out where we're going to set up, our main guy, which mm. is um, Pitology, mm. uh, Tobela, yeah. has to see, check out the room if it's acoustic enough mm. so that the sound will be bouncing around. Uh, where are the mics going to be yes. mic'd up? Mm. The artists, we are going to be performing. So it's stuff like that, saying that it goes back to us, me saying that you have to know what you're doing. Because mm. some would just rock up mm. with the equipment, shoot, mm. and mm. go and edit, mm. and then hand you. Yeah. So as we make sure that sure. your 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 the work we put in for you is quality, is mm. top quality, Absolutely. it's the best. So mm. that when you are watching it, it's like mm. you are watching something out of SABC One or SABC Two. <laughs> Absolutely. <laughs> like standard quality, Absolutely. like TV quality stuff. Getting that, yeah, professional, that professional edge. Yes. To it, and we have a Pia Sankaila, you know, is giving you a shout out. You know, (laughs) awesome. (laughs) So, ladies and gents, you know, listening right now, you know, as as you heard, there's a lot of work that goes behind the scenes, the pre-production, the organization, the arrangement. You know, you have to get your clients' vision, what they actually want to uh, to accomplish. Mm -hmm. You know, I mean, you can't just go through the whole process. Mm -hmm. And the end is like, I don't think this is what I wanted. Mm. And, you know, it ruins the brand yes. and stuff like that. Yes. So, well, um, it's clear that you have done a lot of projects. Um, but do you have anyone in particular that is very memorable or that you really enjoyed? Um, I could say uh, it's, it's, it's our first live stream, mm. which is the one that is a documentary now. Mm. To me, it's memorable because it almost came to a crumble. Wow. It almost came to a crumble. While we were shooting that live stream, mm. a lot of things went wrong. Sure. A lot of things went wrong. Mm. I won't lie to you and say it was all pity. Mm. It's a mm. lot of things went wrong. Um, and then I was panicking. I was in a panic. <laughs> <laughs> Literally, I was sweating, like, like from sweating. Like, from Yeah. Mm. And then everyone was trying to calm me down. Mm. Like, Chris, relax. I'm saying to them, guys, I can't relax because nothing is going right inside there. I'm saying, no, don't worry, chill. Mm. These things happen. I'm saying, yes, but these things happen. Mm. I'm not part of other people where these things happen mm. to. Mm. I don't want that. Mm. I want perfectionist. Mm. I wanted I it to be perfect, mm. yeah, but it didn't. But at the end, we managed to actually get a good product. Mm which is that documentary. So it was memorable to me. That that project of mm. Static Flow mm. was memorable because, yes, I was in a panic stage. Mm. It was, a, since it was like our first one, mm. and mm. it managed to actually get us noticed. Mm. Yes, I could say it wow. managed to get us noticed because uh, that whole, if you go through the, 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 the documentary, you'll mm. see the credits at the end, mm. and then there are sponsors there. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. So to me, that project is like there for me. Like wow, memorable one! Absolutely, it was the memorable one. And you me. can say it, it. It took. It was a start off yes. of everything. Yes. It was yes. a trendsetter, yes. and you know that is one thing uh, that you call maybe like some sort of a you know not benchmark per se, mm-hmm. but uh, something that um, 
you can remember uh, that you had not done anything like this before, before. and stuff like that, and you just took off, mm. and th- that was like just a leap of faith. Yeah, you know? because now when I look at it, I still can't believe it that that's us, you did that it. we did that. <laughs> wow, absolutely. <laughs> Guys, if you are tuning in right now and watching, uh, if he did it, so can you. And talking about you know other people being able to do it, in this information-driven age, that we're living in. I mean, everything is at the top of, uh, you know, cell phone, mm-hmm. just a touch of a screen or something. Uh, Google, YouTube, you name it. You know, many people can easily learn out of YouTube, Google, and also because of great competition. What is it that sets you apart? Or in other words, why should people come to you for photo shoots and the like? All right, okay. Um, with everything that you do, I do believe that you have to have the qualification. Mm. Yeah, you have to have the qualification. You can learn a skill from mm. YouTube. Mm-hmm. You can learn a skill from yeah, it's YouTube. YouTube nowadays is called the University of, <laughs> <laughs> I University think University of Life or something like that. <laughs> I found that after cause I in twenty nineteen after I rested my company, mm. I went to YouTube mm. to take some tutorials, mm. tried some graphic designing. It was a mess. Mm -hmm. And I also, I I found that it was a mess after I actually got qualified. Mm -hmm. And now I'm seeing like, all right, so that's how it's done. Mm -hmm. Because now, right in 2020, when I was doing the the, the qualification film and television production, Mm -hmm. I did remember in 20, my, my, the the live stream was before my quality, my, my learnership. Mm -hmm. So while I was actually doing the learnership, Mm -hmm. I actually got to see why school is important. Mm -hmm for such handling of cameras because mm. film and television you handling of cameras there's producing there's directing there's there's a lot that has to go and with that lot mm. there's actually it's an it's, it's it's a must wow it's a must you must have it because you can't just pick up a camera mm. shoot and mm. then pictures done mm. for me that's not a that's not it mm. there's steps which i was told in school that must be followed mm-hmm. for example shooting a, a, a movie a short film mm. which is like you might see it as something small mm. it's not it's not short by mm. the way it's very not short it's not mm. a short film at all it, it's mm. not it's not mm. it's not uh, since me i'm behind the camera i mm. can tell you that it's hours and hours sure. and hours of work mm. with content that fills up i could say two terabytes of a hard drive and you are only going to see 30 minutes of that. Yeah. You see? <laughs> so in this age, I would say that, yes, you can go to, 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 to YouTube, YouTube, get that uh, mm. tutorial, mm. learn that mm. skill, mm. but balance it with, 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 with the school. qualification mm. school because there's small gaps with mm. you, which you might not find mm. when you are, doing a, you are learning from a tutorial because mm. a tutorial will just give you Mm. the finished product mm. from start to, to mm. the end mm. there's small like small jargons and small small stuff which mm. form a bigger picture to mm. what you are doing absolutely so in this day and age mm. yes um for it's i think it's called for ir fourth industrial yeah, revolution the four, yeah yes. exactly everything is at the touch of a button yes yes touch of a button but if you are going to take something professionally mm. like shooting mm. um videos or pictures mm. balance it with mm. the qualification absolutely mm. and you know they say that the difference between uh, mediocre mm. or average yes, and professional yes. is that that uh, you know, fine one percent that yes. sets you apart. Exactly. You know, but getting that one percent, exactly. the kind of work that goes yeah, into exactly. that one percent is absolutely amazing. You know, I mean, you can consider going to school for film for an entire year, mm-hmm. or you know, there's a lot of work that goes into it, yeah. a lot of detail. Yes. Professionals mm-hmm. know how to focus on details. On details so yeah. definitely, if you wanna, um, you know, get your video done mm-hmm. or your photos. We are talking to the professionals. So for someone who is inspired by your work and would like to jump into photography, what would you recommend they do first? And what gear would you advise under a tight budget? Um, here in the, in the, in the, in the um, entertainment uh, space, mm-hmm. I've worked with a lot of music producers um, and then I'm still going to meet mm. like, TV producers. Mm-hmm. Uh, the um, music producers mm. that I've worked with, mm. uh, even o- Otobiela, mm. uh, they all say that it's not 
the gear. Mm, it's okay. the person behind the gear. All right. Yes. Okay. So you can have like a small digital camera. Excuse mm. me. A small digital camera. I'm not sure how much it costs, but I'm sure it costs less than two thousand. Mm. A digital camera. You can get it at even your your second hand shop. Mm. Start with that. Start with that, or even a cell phone nowadays. Mm. Cell phones that, that take good pictures. Yes. yes. Start with that. Start with that. You don't have to strain yourself with like what we use, because mm. what we use is very expensive. Mm. It's expensive. Mm. The machines we use, actually, you can buy a car with it. <laughs> <laughs> a small lens. I know. Yeah, you so start with that. Mm. Like, get you a digital camera or even a phone. Mm. And then from that, you can actually go to your internet, mm -hmm. your YouTube, and then find um, tutorials on how to take good pictures mm -hmm. with what you have. Because mm -hmm. I'm sure YouTube has it. Absolutely. It could be your digital camera, it mm -hmm. could be your cell phone. Mm -hmm. So don't strain yourself thinking that you need like a DSLR, DSLR camera to be a professional so that you might look professional, but mm -hmm. will you be able to deliver mm -hmm. the professionalism mm -hmm. behind the camera? <laughs> so start yourself off small baby steps mm -hmm. with a digital camera mm -hmm. or a cell phone. Mm -hmm. And then work your way up, work your way up until you actually can afford. Or you will probably see yourself that, no, man, let me now go on to a proper gear, mm. which will be a proper camera. Mm, yes. Absolutely. And I'm sure you would also recommend somebody to go to get a certificate or a school or, yes, you know, yes. whatever it is, yes. just to, to start off to as balance, well. Yes, because, yeah, um, we are still, I'm still in contact with, uh, what do you call it? The colleges I went to, mm. and the audio college, which is the web, mm. and media workshop. So mm. whenever they have posts which are available, like learnerships which are available for, for the public, mm. I actually someone who wants to take part in mm. the learnerships, mm -hmm. I give them the links so that mm. they can apply. Absolutely. Yes. Well, uh, we will uh, share the links on how you can contact uh, Chris Solution Images. So, um, what kind of photography? Uh, or videography are you best known for let's say as as your company as chris uh chris solution chris solution um i could say for the time being we don't have a specific style of photography or mm. video since um the 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 majority of clients um are random mm. so mm. a client would come as one does to take pictures and videos of a wedding that was going to be different from a documentary that is going to be different from um, the, the the interviews mm -hmm. at twelve and that is going to be different from uh, Umkiti, for example. Mm -hmm. So mm -hmm. we tried not to box ourselves with mm -hmm. a specific style mm -hmm. of mm -hmm. photo mm -hmm. or videos mm -hmm. because we want to be as broad as possible. Wow, mm -hmm. that will take a lot of manpower as well. It will take a lot of. Um, learning yes. you know every single time mm -hmm. you have to challenge yourself yes. and get to get to produce of that kind yes. authentic of that kind yes. of thing well absolutely mm -hmm. uh, well these guys are absolutely versatile that means they can actually do any job mm -hmm. that you bring to them so do you um guys have any uh services service packages mm -hmm. or any specials uh anything happening i'm sure the festive season you guys were doing something but in this season uh is there anything packages any specials somebody can actually latch on right now yeah um so far we haven't um fixed uh, our pricing mm. was it still the pricing which we were using last year which mm. is still valid mm. so if you contact us we are still you are still going to get those um, packages which are on the poster mm. on the um, page mm -hmm. the, the radio station page mm. uh, so last year we didn't even run specials during December because we were busy mm. uh, our weekends were busy and, and then the demand. weeks yes um. the weeks we had to do editing and then weekends busy week editing and so the only Pricing and specials we have at the moment are the ones available on the post. Mm -hmm. But we are very soon going to adjust, mm -hmm. adjust, add new services, and then adjust the pricing awesome. on the post. Yeah. Awesome. Yes. So, guys, watch this space. We're going to put something up as soon as uh, we get communications from them. Mm -hmm. So, apart from um, excellent uh, service, which we said there's word of mouth, which brings word of mouth, how else do you guys advertise yourself? Okay. Mostly we advertise through our Facebook page. Yes, our Facebook page on Facebook is Chris Solution Images. That's where we would find most of our advertisement. And we also have an Instagram um, uh, page. Mm -hmm. And that's where we do some of our advertisement. Uh, same name. And then most time it's 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 word of mouth mm, because mm. of 
we work in a space where we hand each other jobs because mm, mm. I don't mind if maybe I'm too busy mm. and then I I, I, I I don't I can't handle mm. more work mm. I'm gonna pass it mm. on to someone mm. and then I'm sure it happens like that to others and Absolutely. then because I've gotten like a call mm. like someone phones me and says that I, I've got your number from um, Sebs, for example, mm. give an example. Mm. Well, a DJ Sebs. <laughs> <laughs> I've got your number from DJ. He says that you can actually assist me in photography. Mm. Oh, he's a photographer himself. Mm. Mm. And I say, yes, I can assist with that. Okay. And then the conversation goes on from there. Mm. Okay. So mm. it's word of mouth and then, yes, and then advertisement through social, through, media, through social media. Yes. Absolutely. And very soon we will be having our um, website, which mm. will be running. Mm. Yes. Mm. And yeah. That's about it. And we also have our YouTube channel, but it's still in construction. Mm. But there are, there are visuals. There's content there's there. Content there is. Absolutely. There's content. We'll put all the links to all the social media. You can check it out later. So um, this is something that I, I just wanted to, um, you know, like um, get some, some of your thinking on this. Mm -hmm. um, what is your comment to photography as industry, uh, seeing that the cell phones are becoming more advanced? Mm -hmm. You know, like we're talking about, I don't know what's the current iPhone, you know, but uh, we're looking at maybe a year from now. We don't even know what cell phones are going to be able to do anymore. Um, you know, they, they only get better and better and better. So uh, in terms of uh, photography as an industry, uh, what is your take on that, um, that somebody now can actually easily pick up a phone and just an amateur, mm -hmm. totally who didn't go to school, but because of all the filters and all the things uh, that, you know, cell phone technology is given people, mm -hmm. um, what do you see as a future of photography? The future of photography is still going to be there. Mm, it's, okay. not, it's not going to die. <laughs> okay. It's not going to die. Anytime soon. All right. Yes, cell phones are actually now becoming part mm. of that side of photography, like professional photography, mm. because you would find that professional uh, photographers mm. um, have cell phones which are compatible to their cameras. Sure. Because now cameras actually have the settings, mm. the DSLRs, which are the cameras mm. we use, mm. the same settings, mm. your apertures, your ISOs, they have, because it was in college that um, our lecturer noted, made us to, to notice that, mm. that from your cell phone, you can actually do settings, the same settings on your camera. I was like, sure. okay. But that he also told us that you can never take away what the camera does mm. by a cell phone. Mm. You can never. The quality is not the same, first mm. of all. Mm. Like, I'm not sure if cell phones can reach 4K or up. Mm. 4K is the yes. highest uh, format, mm. the pixel highest Currently. format, yes, mm. for, that you can get probably from uh, your, your, your DSLR yeah. mm. camera. Mm. I'm not sure where cell phones are because I'm still on the camera side mm. rather than the cell phone side. Mm. I, would murder, I, I, I would actually say that in future, I would carry a cell phone that has the same compatibility settings with the as camera. my camera, just as backup. Mm. If something mm. happens to my camera, mm. I'm gonna be there shooting with, with my camera. Mm. Yeah, because mm. to me it would look unprofessional if yeah, I get I to know. the gig and I shoot <laughs> with a cell phone. I know the people will be like, "Oh, we paid you, bro. <laughs> <laughs> That's a cell phone. You gonna give us footage with a cell phone? The pictures might come out okay, but still, it's not gonna look professional. I know. <laughs> so if you're going to use a cell phone, use it at your own leisure, at mm. own time for mm. your own portfolio. But mm. I wouldn't recommend it for you to use it professionally for a gig. Mm. Rather stick to a to to a camera. Absolutely. So the 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 photography is not going anywhere. Mm. Yes, there are cell phones which are, which are going to evolve. The technology is going to evolve, but photography and its equipment are still going to be number one. For mm. you. Absolutely, mm. absolutely. I mean, that is he's being very optimistic. I must put it that way. Uh, well, he, we are talking to the professional, so we better listen to what the professional said. They know uh, what you know is in that field, and we just have to take it, you know, from them. And what is the future of um, Chris Solution Images? Where are you seeing yourself in the next five years? Let's five say five years. Ah, yeah, five years. I talked about it uh, with, oh, I think it was last year. Mm. And there's also another guy that we work with, which is Luvoyo, mm. Bell, mm. um, that I want to do a short film mm. with Chris Solution Images. It's, it's something I want to do. It might be this year, it might be next year, next five years. Mm -hmm. So one, that's one mm -hmm. on the cards. And in the next five years, I actually want to see myself on... MTV base, Channel mm. O, on SABC. 
it is going to happen though. It is. It's, it is going to happen. <laughs> that's a definite. It is, it's a definite happen. It's definitely happening. <laughs> so that's why where I see Crystal Dot Image is that mm-hmm. more of our content to be on your TVs, to be on your YouTubes, to be on your probably Facebooks or Instagram, mm-hmm. to be all over. Mm-hmm. Our pictures and our visuals. Mm-hmm. That's 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 what we see from short films to music videos, to any other occasions which you might want us to come and shoot for you. Mm, absolutely, absolutely. Ladies and gents, uh, that has been 30 minutes of an incredible conversation. We are so excited about Chris Solution Images. Uh, watch out this space, as you've heard. They want to be in all your spaces. You know, uh, They want to be you know, giving quality, uh, whether it's photography or videography. Uh, contact them. Uh, how can viewers and listeners contact you? Do you have any WhatsApp number? Mm-hmm. Um, you know what? What's your Facebook page um, and stuff like that? Email address. Okay. Give it up. Um, contact numbers. It's 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 zero seven two nine thousand three two one. It's zero seven two nine triple zero three two one. And the number has working hours. People. Okay. It has working hours. Yo, please respect that. All right. From eight up until six. Mm. Yes, you can contact me on that mm. number. Mm. Eight in the morning up until six. Mm-hmm. And then on Sundays, the number is off. Mm-hmm. You can contact me for any of the businesses, of my businesses, which you might find mm-hmm. on Facebook. Mm-hmm. And then on Facebook, we are Chris Solution Images. And on Instagram, it's Chris Solution Images. And then, yes, on, yes, our YouTube channel, mm-hmm. you can search Chris Solution Images. And then on the, cha- on, 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 on the Facebook page, our email is there. Mm. Our email address is there. It's chrissolutionimages at mm. gmail.com. Mm-hmm. Yes. And uh, yeah, that's that's uh, that's about it. Uh-huh. And website is coming very soon. Yes. Watch this it. space. Yes. Uh, well, ladies and gents, it's such an honor for me uh, to have been having a conversation. Thank you, Chris. Thank you, uh, Thank you for your thank time. You, you, um, guys, uh, we're going to drop in all the contact details so you can get in touch with them. We'll be very excited uh, to hear that, um, well, you were able to get in touch with them after this uh we're going to listen to you changed my life by pastor saki the time now is exactly 32 minutes past 1 p.m on a very beautiful wednesday afternoon stay in tune because we have uh pastor bubusi more coming in at 4 p.m but before that we have the amazing ladies uh shante and tammy coming in for um, the Agape's top 10 playlists. Please tune in. We're going to hear an amazing conversation uh, with me. It's going to be adios and check you later. Goodbye. Mm-hmm.